off by giving our praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem, Rakakadesh, the runners of the apostles and the others of Great Millstone that taught me this truth. Alright, do the listen entitled I'll Go Unto One Place. Alright, now, the, um, before I can get into explaining what this lesson, you know, um, I'll Go Unto One Place. Um, let me start off with um, someone once asked me why Genesis 38. All right, I'm going to read verses 8 through 10. And Judah said unto Owen, Go unto thy brother's wife, marry her, raise up seed to thy brother. And Owen knew that the seed should not be his. And it came to pass when he went into his brother's wife, that he spilt it on the ground, lest that he should give seed to his brother. And the thing which he did displeased the Lord, wherefore he slew him. Alright, so, um, somebody was asking me why come they never um, teach this in um, the um, plantation Christian churches, alright? And the truth is, I believe it's because, um, is a reincarnation cut. You know, a lot of people know go into the um, laws of ownership and try to say that's all it was all about. But I believe it's because it was reincarnation. You know, he was supposed to go into his brother wife so that, you know, Judah's seed would still be going on through his brother's wife, you know, and his brother, you know, could come back. So, I believe that's why it's not top. Not because of the prophecy laws and people try to say, but because it's a reincarnation cut, they leave it out. And I, right? because, um, you know, this uh, false hell doctrine, you know, they make a lot of money dealing with it, you know, these churches do. So, um, first thing that gets is to get into, that's the brain that, um, Hell is a condition, not a place. All right. Let's start with Jonah. Two. One through four. Then Jonah prayed unto Yahweh. My bad. Start off. Then Jonah prayed unto the Lord, his Yahweh, out of the fish's belly, and he said, I cried by reason of my affliction unto the Lord and he heard me and out of the bed of hell cried I and thou hearest my voice alright so out of the bed of hell cried I so this is Jonah letting us know that he was in hell when he was in the fish's bed alright um, cause you know he probably was nobody you know, in the fish's bed probably sitting in there getting ready to depose Jonah was in hell, alright? So, there's one cut that this hell is a condition or the grave and, you know, not a physical place on the ground. A pit, grave, condition. That's what hell is. Let's get um, a few more verses. Let's see. Let's see. What is Let's go to Psalms. Psalms, let's see, 116, all right, the sorrow of death could pass me by, and the pains of hell get hold unto me, I find trouble and sorrow, then I call unto the name of Yahweh, O Lord, I beseech thee, deliver my soul, all right, so he said he called him to the name of power. Oh Lord, I beseech thee, deliver my soul. The sorrows of death could pass me by. The pains of hell got hold unto me. I find trouble and sorrow. So this is letting you know it was the condition that he was in at this time. All right. Them yeah, Psalms. Thirty. All right, Psalms thirty-two, three. Oh Lord, 
my power I cry to thee, and thou hast healed me. O Lord, thou hast brought me up my soul from the grave. Thou hast kept me alive that I should not go down into the pit. Alright? And if you look up them words, um, it's the same word, you know, for grave and pit as it is for hell, I believe in them. Alright? same word that they use for for um, hell Shaul Strong's H 7585 Shaul Shaul and second entry Shaul Shaul alright alright now give me uh, some we in songs, but we'll do one more. Now, this is Psalms 18, 4 through 5. The sorrows of death could pass me. The floods of the ungodly man made me alive. The sorrows of hell could pass me about, and the slurs of death prevent me. And you see, 7585, same word used for here. Strong's H, 7585. Sheol, Sheol. And second entry, Sheol, Sheol. Alright, and just to reiterate it, let's go to um, Genesis 37, verse 35. Let me read the verse first. All his sons and all his daughters rose up to comfort him, but he refused to comfort. And he said, For I will go down into the grave until my son mourn. Thus his father wept for him. Uh, this is um, Jacob, you know, and um, when he got Joseph, you know, was dead when his brothers sold him into Egypt, right? And we go. All right. Into the grave, see the same word. Strong's H, seventy-five, eighty-five. Sheol, Sheol. So that's and second entry. Sheol. So she grave, hell, same word. All right. All right. Yeah. Let's get one more about. Let's see. Hell being a condition. Alright. Though thou dig into hell, then shall my hand take them. Though thou climb into heaven, then will I bring them down. Alright. This is a dig into hell. So that's like a hole, a grave in the ground right there. Alright. It's a condition. It just means a low state. That's where you get when you get the word hell. Okay? Now, let's see if I can... Uh, see one more. Oh, yeah. Let's get some... Let's get one out the... Um, one or two out the New Testament. Since I've been getting everything out the Old Testament. to uh, I'm going to read 30 and 31 I believe therefore being a prophet and knowing that 
and knowing that power has sworn with an oath unto him, that of the fruits of the lawns, according to the flesh, he will raise up Yahweh to sit on his throne. He seen his this before spoke of the resurrection of Amashiach, that his soul was not lifted, was not left in hell, neither the flesh did see corrupt. So he wasn't left in the grave. He was not, his soul was not left in hell. And right now, if it was you no, know, if hell meant what you got thought it meant, why would your house Amashiach be in hell if it was this place where you just burn forever? You know what I'm saying? He's saying that Yahusha Amashiach was not left in hell in this verse. Alright? The, the Savior is not going to be in a hell, a place burning. So, obviously, the definition for hell that we think it is got to be wrong, okay? Now, let's get one more in this, all right? Revelation 20. Fourteen, all right. In the death in hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. Alright, now if hell is this uh, place of fire where you burn and burn, how is hell getting cast into hell? Cause the, the, it is not this um, place, you know. It's a death in hell was cast into the lake of fire. You know, the second death, because you know these missiles coming or whatever. Alright. So obviously that is not what they mean. Alright. And let's see if I God came out to, you know, um, I think I'm going to break this up into two parts and I'm going to leave this part as playing in the hill as a condition, not a place. And now I'm going to go into the second part, part two, um, of I'll go into one place.